Hi everyone. So finally we have the date for the NEET PGA exam. It is on March 5th and uh, 2023. This is uh, what we had talked about recently in our video which I have uploaded on the YouTube where I have given you an idea that we have time. So what should we do now? Now this is the time to wake up if you were a late starter, you have not started till now, this is a good idea now. This is a, probably a signal from high above that you know, you were thinking of a January exam and you were getting helpless but there is time to still make up. So the exam is in March, we have good amount of time and I want to reassure all the damn students that we are right on track for the schedules. We would be finishing all of our schedules by November end or first week of December in almost all of our centers and from 12th of December we have planned the DAMS DVT in the uh, auditorium in Delhi and from 13th it will be on the eMedicos app live. So uh, the DVT is right on schedule every year we do the DVT around 3 months before the NEET PG so we are on right on track. I want to reassure you that this year's DVT again will be a mega event where we will revise all the high yield topics for you in a you know, uh, enthusiastic approach, a very high yield approach and a very highly uh, like uh, selective approach. We are always known for our crisp, concise material and we will uh, continue the tradition with the DAMS DVT as well. If you are a late starter, I want to remind you that we are going to soon start the 3C course which is the crisp, concise crash course. So if anybody subscribes to the crash course, you will have access to the crash course along with DVT, along with online test series, which will include the GTs and SWTs with video solutions and your previous year paper discussion, which is what I believe should be done if somebody is starting late and wants to cover their entire syllabus in remaining months. The ideal way will be to balance the concept and the content into a crisp manner, which is the crash course. You should be giving subject wise test. You should be giving grand test. You should be looking at previous year questions. So all of that is included in the uh, crisp concise crash course also. DVT subscription is included for our regular course students, TND students and our cr crash course students also. And uh, I'm so excited about the exam date finally getting announced. It was so much of pressure on all the students. I would like to thank the exam board for finally announcing the date well in advance so that the students have ample time now to prepare for the exam and to make their plans accordingly. I wish all the students all the best and at DAMS we are totally committed to your cause. And I want to also tell you that and in the end, the entire idea in the end should be to stick to high yield. Many times we, you know, increase the bulk of our material but anything that you cannot revise ultimately is not useful in the exam. So stick to high yield. Your class notes, your test papers, your grand tests, and probably the two most critical things will be look at the previous year papers and start practicing GTs now. As soon as the, you know, the war siren, which is the date of the exam is, uh, you know, there and you know that, okay, this is the time where I need to go into my next phase. So you will start your revision from December. December end January, February would be your revision months. This would be your revision month. Try finishing your syllabus by November end or December mid that should be the idea because this was a year which was already late so don't compare with your senior who had more time you have this year the last NEET PG actually happened in May and the results came in June July so you had less time you can give yourself up till mid of December also to finish your first go and you can listen to my last video on the YouTube channel where I have described how to go about the first phase and the second phase First phase will be till 15th of December and the second phase after that. So this should be your idea and DVT will be the watershed area where we will revise everything for you. I also want to use this opportunity to remind you that we are going to do three CBTs in computer centers. One will happen in October on the INICT pattern, one in December and the second December uh, CBT will be pushed to January. So we will be rescheduling our December CBTs according to the dates that have been announced. So you can register for CBT on cbt.damsdaily.com to register for appearing for the exam in actual exam centers. I also want to tell you that it is not late. Many times students keep asking me, sir, is it too late? Is it too late? Now I want you to understand that looking at a March date, you have ample time. 
I have seen people do it with crash courses in the last four or five months. It is always possible to crack the exam in this duration. You have to, you know, keep believing in it. And you have to tell yourself that because I am starting late, I will not be drawn into useless material. I will focus on crisp material. That should be your idea. More look at the previous year questions, look at the start practicing GT, revise your notes, don't accumulate your material with unnecessary material, start getting into high yield mode. It is a good thing that the date of exam is announced because otherwise there was so much uncertainty about either the exam will be in January or will we have a next or so much uncertainty was there. Finally, all those things are cleared. I am grateful for this and I wish all of you the best. I want you to know. It is still possible. There is enough time to do it. This is the time to go all out so that you don't create any regrets for yourself in this exam. Go ahead and make it happen. I wish you all all the best.